Hello, my name is Karak City 2 and welcome back to our Project Ozone mode playthrough. I am just crafting up some of the three ingots for the quantum uh, compressors. Fortunately, it is pretty slow going, and uh, I have seen quite a few comments about animating these. Um, Seems like every other episode we get a comment, and I don't know if it was possible in the past, but it is not possible anymore. So um, that is why we are having to craft that up. I don't know if a uh, update disabled that, and also the mob spawners cannot be animated. So I think it's just regular blocks. I don't think tile entities can be animated anymore. So as we see, I'm shift clicking to animate that. Right clicking just opens it up. So unfortunately we cannot animate those. So uh yeah, if maybe it was possible in the past, I don't know. But uh it does not appear to be possible now. But uh unfortunately, as we remember, each quantum compressor requires four uh eight. And I think that means it's I think it's thirteen thousand first degree ingots per eight uh degree. So uh, it's definitely uh, a bit slow, but we may see over here. Um, I have expanded this, and now I have two towers of pyrothium. Uh, getting uh, smelted down, and then six flu transposers for this one. Um, so I find that 16 does about three, just about keeps up with three. So it's running permanently. So as we can see, I have 109,000 first degree ingots. Just noticing this is turned off. Did this go through all of this? Yes. All right. So let's just get rid of that. Um, I was crafting up the third degree ingots and I decided to, or second degree ingots, and decided to switch it over to this tower. And I had to empty out the A system of the cryothium. Um, so that's what that was. And then we can just turn this on. There we go. That is just creating the cryothium. And uh, yeah, there we go. So this is just pulling from here. And I have it on a smaller ratio, as we can see. So if we first, I don't know why we would ever need first degree ingots, but we're always going to have more first degree than third degree, I think. I could be wrong, though, because this actually does use three. It's three to one, isn't it? I was thinking it was two to one, but I don't know. We'll see. I think we're getting. It did seem like I was getting a bit more first degree, but. This obviously was turned off as well, so now it's it's ramping up here. Um, once these all fill up, they'll slowly fill up. But anyway, uh, that is kind of where we're at right now. I'm thinking... Maybe... You know what? I think... Maybe we'll just, I was going to break all this down, but maybe I'll leave it just in case we need to craft up some of the first degree ingots for some reason, like, or, uh, well, we don't even need that anymore. I'm thinking, like, I was using it for, like, this, but I could just get a block of this if I want, and I never have to do that. I don't know. I could probably go ahead and break this down, but anyway, um, we still have the third degree is now that's kind of like the backlog. So I'm just kind of doing this. I think I needed one more finishes off that thing. So yeah, now we have the second degree. The third degree is the the backlog here. I have it done. I have three magma crucibles set up to do this, but uh, it's still a bit slow. But uh, yeah, 
Uh, I set up the glowstone, so we need gold and diamond. Gold block, diamond block. Gold. Oh, I don't. I don't not. Ha I don't have gold blocks learned. That surprises me, actually. Is that? Oh, it's block. Oh, gold. Not gold block, isn't it? Yeah. All right. I that I thought that was a bit weird that I wouldn't have that learned. Um, ultimate. I should have a bunch of black iron. Yeah, we have 266 blocks of black iron, so that's terrible. Now, I don't really know if this is the best way to be doing this. It's kind of working out so far. Um, we are going to run into an issue at some point. I do know that, but, uh, For now, it seems to be working. Because this, I haven't looked at every single one, but this whole row, they all have um, EMC, so. I don't know, I just feel like, I don't know, is there any, is there a faster way to do this? I don't really think there's a faster way to do this, to be honest, without doing, I don't know. No, it's definitely not fast exporting it from the A system. That is slow as heck. Not that this really needs to be super fast, I don't... Well, no, we're probably going to need a lot of these eternal singularities. What am I talking about? So... Oh, I forgot to get ultimate catalyst. That's what I was waiting for. Ultimate, there we go. So, yeah, basically just uh, trying to improve everything to go faster is basically what um, we're kind of at at the moment. I do need to throw some more EMC in here. I may um, hold first, wasn't it? Diamond. For some reason it doesn't work. It doesn't seem like you can... Oh, no power. Duh. Throw those on there. Let's see, that doesn't... It doesn't want to manually do it. That's a bit weird. You can't manually do that, but... Now, these are actually quite expensive. Well, not expensive. But, uh... I mean, I'm putting 262 billion in there, so I think that should... Should last, but, uh... Yeah, there we go. There is that. Diamond Singularities. We're up to there. Only all this to go. Now, is there anything like crazy that we're doing here? No, all this stuff has. Roll. That has it. Pretty sure, like, tungsten. Yeah. Invar, Electrum, Lumium, this all has Manulin. Yep, that does. Elven Quartz does. Yep. Base Quartz. All this Mana Quartz stuff has Awakened Draconium. That doesn't. All right. So I'm going to have to mark these down, which ones do not have. And that's a lot. <laughs> that is a lot. Um, I'm going to have to, well, we obviously, we have this automated in the mob spawner, but we'll probably have to do a dedicated one just for that. So um, I'll have to go through here, kind of see what uh, needs to be 
Electricine, iron wind, fiery, steely. This all has EMC. So, so far it looks like there's only one, only one, gosh. Night metal, bismite. Pretty sure most, all this, this, this doesn't. All right, so there's one. 9,000 crystal disc. Oh man. <laughs> hey, we'll just have to, uh, hopefully this will be automatable. Stellar Vivid, that all has it. All right, just quickly looking over this, Flux Lushroom doesn't. Melodic does. All right, I think yeah i it looks like i'm just it was a quick run over that um i don't know exactly but i'm seeing three off the top of my head that does not have emc so of all that being able to just do emc for everything is uh that makes that not that difficult it seems like the hardest part's going to be just the quantum compressors to be honest because these well that's not even hard it just takes a long time um, so I'm thinking, uh, I might want to set up another tower for the third degree. Because as we can see, this is kind of, this is the backlog now. Um, all right. So let me cut here and, uh, do some more crafting and building. Unfortunately, this isn't the um it's not the fastest <laughs> setting this whole thing up it's not i mean i'm just usually the conduit probe and stuff but i mean i'm getting a bit faster but it's not like just throwing down one machine and it's it's a bit more complicated than that but uh yeah let me cut here and we'll come back and we are back, and I've uh, set up a, another tower. I'm just kind of doing 16 and 3. I feel like, I don't know, just kind of randomly pick that. It seems like a decent number, but uh, yeah, so we have 1, 2, and 3 now for the ingots. And uh, yep, now we're up to 5,000 of the third degree. Um, I will probably do the fourth degree. Might as well just do that. Um, but for now, I'm just going to kind of leave it. Um, don't remember. I think it's 760 of the... Fourth, third. 834 of the third degree. So uh, let me actually... Because nine, it, there's like nine in a row. So like nine's a kind of a good number. Um, well, I got to check that. Also, um, niter. The erothium, I had... I had the um, this recipe. Because I was like, that was the first one that popped up. And I was like, oh shoot, there's no EMC. But there's other versions of niter that uh, do have EMC. So... Just so you know, <laughs> but uh, I just noticed it right there. So what are twenty-seven thousand is like nothing. So eight, about eight thousand third degree. I didn't see the fourth in there. Where was the fourth? All right, three thousand. Yeah, it takes a little while, but uh, all right. I just wanted to get the amount since I have. About 8,000. So probably when I hit 8,000 something, third degree, I'll craft up nine more of the quantum compressors. We'll do them all at once. Um, really quick. Why is this not? What is turned off? Ooh, is this, is it that? Yes. And that stuff's annoying. All right, I got to get that sorted out. Um, ethylene and oxygen. I got to get that pulled out and just voided. 
Um, can I? What's that? Um, uh, ga gauge? Yeah. Will this work just to get it going again? Did something. No. Well, there we go. It does pull a thousand. Um, yeah, I'll just have to set up. Oh, I don't have a fluid one. I'll have to set up something just to void the ethylene because I don't think. Okay, I don't remember this exact setup. I'll have to look at it really quick. But uh, ethylene. I think it's regular ethylene and yeah, liquid ethylene. All right, so that can actually wait. Right, this ethylene is being pulled out, but I'm not using it fast enough. That's right. Although, why isn't that filling up? Wouldn't that be filling up? I, that's right. I remember now. I had this turned off um, because I accidentally got a whole bunch in a tank and I was emptying the tank. That's what the tank was sitting right here. Um, so I had that turned off. That's right. All right. So I was trying to get this oxygen sorted out. Yeah, that's what I was doing. I'll get... Eh. Let's turn that... Nope, that was not... Pause that really quick. Let's see if I have the setup right. Insert brown. Yeah, that, see that oxygen? Oh, there we go. Yeah, that's, it's a bit awkward. All right, um, I think we did this. No, I didn't. That's turned off. That's turned off. Insert brown. No, dang it. Anyway, uh, I will have to do that. Um, but for this episode, uh, I'm thinking, um, since I'm kind of like in between kind of stuff here, I think I actually want to. I know we have solar panels all over the place. I'm kind of wanting to build a uh, the Draconic Energy Core or energy thing. So I think I'm actually going to go ahead and craft that up. Now, it does unfortunately require... A bunch of draconium and that is all going in to the um, that'll eventually all get put into first degree ingots so but I mean I don't think I'm gonna use this won't use like a ton but we need one of that and we need four of those Yeah, and the reason I want to do this is because, like I mentioned, I uh, I want to clean up the base a bit. And uh, to do that, I think getting a good central power system uh, would be good. question is, do I want to do it above the base or below the base? I kind of like the draconic energy thing, but uh, that's just me. So we don't need... Man, it has been a while since I built this. Um, do we need these on a small one? Let me get everything crafted up here. And um, let me figure out how big I want this as well. I don't... Do we want to go for like a tier, tier 8? I don't know. Yeah, let me figure out what I want to do, what size, and where I want to put it, and we will come back.
And we're back. I think I'm just going to do uh, tier 5 to start out with. Um, and then I will upgrade that when we get enough Awakened Draconium. I have some of this stuff spawning. Now, I know this isn't the fastest kind of spawning here. Um, but, uh, yeah. So I'm just kind of spawning that in. Because the, the tier 8 one, which I want to get, um, requires like 800 of those. So that's going to take a little while. Um, but I think, uh, yeah, I need what, 90 of that, I think it said. Oh, let's look again really quick. Uh, energy storage, we're set up. So we'll just do the tier five, 90 draconium, 80 redstone block. At so 90 draconium, 80 redstone. There's that. Uh, I think I am gonna do it above because solar panel is probably gonna be how we power this thing. So, how about like, I don't want it like right over this. When it's a tier eight, it's gonna be pretty large. Is that? Well, I, well, these things don't place exactly where you are. So that actually, fine, that, that there. All right, and then build guide, we'll do tier five. There we go. So basically that is the tier five. It's not very big, is it? <laughs> but uh, it gets much, much bigger. So there's the tier eight. Eventually it's gonna be that big. Yeah, I think that's a decent height. And then we will just pipe out the power to the different areas, I think. So I want to, I guess we can do the center I'm just thinking I think I want that out that is one I'm just trying to figure out the stabilizer things so one two three four yeah we'll do it I think we'll do it here. So basically, we do nine of these. It's nine, right? Or is it? Yeah, nine. All right. So we do nine of those, five out from the tier eight. But we're not going to do the tier eight. I'm just doing this to get set up so I don't have to move it later. That. Well, it needs to go here. So then we just set these up on all four sides. Um, the reason I'm kind of doing the tier five is because the tier eight's gonna need these. So I wanted to get these all kind of set up. Why? That's two out. Four. I already forgot. Is it on the fourth or is it on the fifth? It's on the f I think that's, yeah, it's like four out and then it's on the last, that one. I can always uh, fix this when we When I'm not recording. All right, so last one. All 
right, so one, two, three, four. And if that's not the case, I will I'll switch on my... I don't know if... Do they need to be all even? I'm assuming they probably need to be even on all sides. I actually don't know, though. All right. So there's those, at least. Now, let's put this back down to a tier four. Five. Do that. Uh, it's a... Oh, layer. I thought this said laser. I'm like, what is layer? <laughs> does it do anything? Oh, it does. All right, that's good. Um, because I always thought that was a bit difficult to see when you're building it. But uh, yeah, basically just put the stuff where it needs to go and pull it. Fortunately, I can't reach the core anymore, but you can click on these. So there, there's layer two. Uh, it's basically just building a circle around the uh, energy core. It may be right, but just do a layer at a time because I inevitably do something wrong. It's very difficult to find that. that. That's that. Then we just start. It's just, just we cover everything up with the uh, draconium. Oh no, we have more redstone. You kind of get a bit faster at it once you uh, paste it. Did I do a tier five? I feel like I have. Oh, maybe not. Just felt like I have more redstone than I said we needed. I probably need it on the bottom as well, too. Did we do it on the bottom yet? Yeah. Alright. No, I had the right amount. Alright, there's that. And then basically we just cover it up with draconium. Wherever redstone is showing is basically where you put draconium. So this part's easy. There. I could maybe do like use a wand or something, but I'm pretty sure this has to be manually done. There's no like automatic way to Place the draconic thing is there? I don't remember that ever being a thing. That basically cover up all the redstone. We should have a energy core. Place two of those. That was annoying. Yeah, and uh, since we're flying, <laughs> it's harder to, uh, slower to break them. So let's place these in the right spot so we don't have to do that again. All right, and last, cross our fingers, I did this correctly. Activate. Ah, nice. All right, so there we go. There is thing and it looks like i got all uh, the things even so all right there is the energy core it has 59 billion which is laughably small with how much we produce at the moment uh, but i just wanted to get this uh crafted up now we need to get some power in and i guess we could do some power outs just to kind of get it going now you can just put this wherever you want but uh
Um, how about, sure, right here. And um, I think that is close enough, so we'll put that there. Now that's N, energy N. And we need a piece of glass. I have learned glass, right? There we go. Um, and then we will feed the ink in. Oops, no, that's on the wrong one. Just kidding. This needs to be below it. Ball needs to be, if you're above it, the ball needs to be below, so it's on that side of it. If you're below it, then the ball needs to be on top. So we're basically going to pipe power into this, and um, are these difficult to craft? No, not really. Um, maybe we'll we'll probably get into that next episode. Maybe. Um, yeah, I think you can just pipe. You can just pipe. Um, You can just pipe in, right? Usually when I craft this up, I do the Draconic power. But uh, I'm pretty sure this is possible, right? So, put one solar down, just to see. That's... Can you not do that? I actually don't know. All right, uh, let's craft up uh, one of the... It's like, I don't know if that's actually possible to do it that way. I know that that's input. I do know that. Uh, yeah, let's craft up one of those draconic things really quick. Um, the recipe didn't look too difficult, right? Just kidding. So we're going to need, can we do, okay, Wyvern doesn't need it. Let's just do Wyvern then. That one takes a second. I don't know why that one does. So there's the basic. It only see, that one has a slight lag. Nothing else seems to lag, but that one has to seem to have a slight lag. So, all right. We'll make some of these input outputs. Um, and then we can always upgrade them if we want, but Oh, that's the wireless. That's what I was looking at the wrong thing. Oh, shoot. Did I? No, I got the right thing, I think. Yeah. Um, this one, yeah, it does need a fusion reactor. So, pretty sure. Is there a link? There's a linking tool, isn't there? Is there? I'm trying to remember. Yes, this thing. I think. Isn't this the uh, the binder? Man, I feel like it has been a long time since I've used uh, Draconic. The power system. Goodness, where is over here? All right, so it's getting power. Um, uh, right click. Click. There we go. Um, I need to output that. The open hand, is that what it is? Yes. No. Shift right. There we go. Shift right click. I think. Be up. Oh, I have. Duh, I have particles turned off. <laughs> so of course you're not gonna see. Uh, that that's funny. I was like, oh, it's not working. Why isn't it working? I have particles turned down. There we go. So that's why. See, this is what happens when I turn particles off. I screw up, <laughs> and that's my excuse. And I am sticking to it. Um, I haven't turned off for that. Although those particles don't seem to go away. 
So, uh, particles decrease minimal. So, I don't know. Maybe I'll leave the particles back on. I don't know. We'll see. All right. So there is the Draconic uh, thing. Now, like we said, there is a tier 8. I will probably upgrade that. Um, I just needed to wait and get some more of the... Um, I need 786 Draconium and 378 Awakened Draconium. So that is going to take a little while. And, uh, hey, what are you doing out there? Get back in there. Um, yeah. So I think I'm going to do the fourth. I'll just do another tower, the, the fourth thing. And, um, we're getting close to a nine thing. So I'll probably do that here. And, um, yeah, I feel like we're doing pretty decent progress. Um, we may be at the point though, I may have to start, uh, doing a Project Goes On 3 episode every, every like two days as opposed to every other day. I just feel like, cause we're kind of getting to the point where it's, uh, there's not a whole lot to show off. It's a lot of just kind of doing the same thing and expanding the base and just ramping everything up. So I don't know. We'll see. Um, for now, we're still doing every other day, but we may be going to every two days here um, coming up here. But anyway, that's going to be it for this episode. So thanks for watching and have a good one.